hello guys welcome back to my channel on a quick one today i'm going to be showing you how i mix my dozen ocean soap with other natural ingredients to give me a very flawless and beautiful skin okay so dozen ocean as we all know is a bar soap that has already been formulated many people use this soap to treat acne and get a smooth skin and this one bar weighs about 150 grams so i created about two bars weighing about 300 grams into my plate and i'm mixing it with about 200 grams of white ball soup this white Ghana ball soups will help do the ocean to lather more we know the do ocean ladders very well but this one will also help the soap to lather more and to increase the quantity of the soap and also for deep cleansing white ball soap helps to cleanse deep with its other new nutrients and minerals that it contains so i'm just gonna shred the white ball soaps into my can of soap gently and i'll mix together dudu ocean is a very beautiful soap and if you are the kind of person that do not like organic products but you like um, black soups you can go for dudu ocean as your black soap as a normal bathing soap because dudu ocean is really really a beautiful soap most times when i'm out of my bathing soap natural soups i opt for dudu ocean before i make another okay so the first ingredient to be adding to this mix is our sandalwood powder here is 20 grams of sandalwood powder Sandalwood is a natural wood crushed into powder that has the capability of fighting acne, cleansing pores, and soothing the skin. It has so many um, antibacterial effects and it's a beautiful ingredient to add to natural recipes. Especially in black soaps, face packs, and other natural recipes, sandalwood also have a little brightening property. The next powder I'll be adding into this is our carrot powder. This powder is gotten from dried and crushed carrots and contains natural brightening and glowing properties that will also help in fighting hyperpigmentation on the skin and other skin problems. Carrot powder is an excellent ingredient to add into your recipes or do it can be substituted or opt, opt out entirely the next ingredient here is our turmeric powder here is about 10 grams of turmeric i'm using a little quantity because turmeric always color and when you add too much of it you might end up beating with yellow color the yellow color soap so i'm adding turmeric because of its numerous skin care properties that it's packed with turmeric is an excellent ingredient to add into any of your recipes the next ingredient here is our goat's milk powder you can always substitute this for cow milk if you can't get rid of goat's milk and goat's milk um, is a protein that contains not nat um, lactic acid naturally and it will help in giving a gentle exfoliation on the skin it will help to smoothen the skin it will help to clean pores not naturally and so the next ingredient here is our alpha abutin alpha abutin powder is a lightning powder this is about 10 grams of alpha abutin into our recipe i use i like using alpha abutin because it is one of the safest whitening natural powders to use especially when you use it in the right range and dose it would not give you any side effect it has lesser side effect than every other whitening powder it's really really safe i recommend afabutin into any of your recipe and then i'm going to be supporting this afabutin with 10 grams of kojic acid kojic acid is also a whitening and powder although many people do not like using kojic in their recipe but kojic is still better than so many other whitening powders so I'm supporting this with just 10 grams of kojic acid powder. And then for our oils, the first oils I'll be using here is our jojoba oil. Here is about 20 ml of jojoba oil. And then I'm just going to transfer this into my bowl. 
and then after a whole bar oil i'll be adding some flour oil 20 grams also sunflower oil is a very very light carrier oil that has a way of penetrating into the skin very fast carrying its other ingredient that it has been mixed with into the skin so it's a very very hard working oil and a better choice in recipes like this i'll also be going in with my honey my raw honey into this recipe honey is a moisturizer honey is a skin saver honey helps to treat damaged skin honey helps in sunburn in eczema honey helps to clear scars and a whole lot honey is a natural skin saver so i didn't measure my honey specifically here i just used it on a random you can add more and you can add less depending on what you want and how much of honey you have so i'm just going to mix all together before adding the remaining ingredients After mixing to this point, I'm going to be adding rose water to this. This is about 30 ml of rose water to lighten up the consistency of the soup. I'll also go ahead to add about 30 ml of herbal water, also known as omiyaru, into this. Herbal water is a residue that is gotten from the making of the traditional black soup and it really contains a lot of minerals and nutrients and it helps also in deep cleansing it cleans and remove pores and dead skin as well so i'm gonna mix this together uh, making sure that my soup has the consistency that i want it to have also you can use your mortar and pestle to pound this if you think you cannot match this thoroughly with your hands I'm only doing this because it's really a small quantity and I don't want to stress myself bringing out the mortar and the pistol. If you've watched this video to this point, I really want to appreciate you for supporting this channel always. And then for those of you who just joined us and this is your first time on this channel, I really welcome you specially and I appeal to you that you hit on the subscribe button, turn the notification bell so that you can always get our post. And also join this big family always watch our videos and you would love every bit of them and to our returning subscribers thank you for your support every time okay so here is the consistency we've gotten and i think this is okay because black soap is still going to solidify after everything so i'm just going to add this and transfer this into my container note that i didn't add any essential oil fragrance or uh, every other excipient this is because the base to the ocean has already been produced initially and i believe those things were added into it the ocean has its own fragrance and the fragrance is fine so there is no need adding other fragrance or adding essential oils because i do not know the quantity of essential oils that was added into their product and i do not want to add more because essential oil is okay when added just a little so here is our Dudun Ocean Mixed Black Soup with Alpha Abutin and Kojic Acid and this soup helps in cleansing deep and lightening the skin. It's actually a lightening formulation and you can see the effect within 3 weeks of use. So I don't know if this video is helpful to you. Please, if it is, give this video a thumb up. Follow us on Instagram and on Facebook and also subscribe to this channel. Please subscribe to this channel. 
if you're going to try out this recipe let me know in the comment section and if you've already tried it out uh, i want to hear your feedback from this also if you want to assess the ingredients you can check the description box for the link to purchase ingredients thank you so much for watching this video and i'll surely see you in my next video bye